Cecil McDonald Jr., photographer and teaching artist. My work as a teaching artist is based in uh, mentorship. Photography, sound, writing, poetry supports all of that. I realized that I was always looking at things, really seeing the world in a very intense way. Um, and photography, I, through photography, I learned that I, I could capture that and like fix it and show it to people. Teaching photography is a very abstract thing. And we just found that we could talk all day about photographs and we could show them examples of it, but still it wouldn't click that I'm not close enough to the subject. So what the Remix Project did was they had the dual function of showing master works and the other function was, okay, if I copy this photograph, I'm really trying to replicate what the artist did. And it's a, it's a common art school assignment. So each student had their own assignment to do that took place at home, in the neighborhood, in the community. But then it was a school-wide project. I teach art in a way to integrate the education and their lives. Through my professionalism, through my travels, uh, I can bring the world to them. If they can see um, agency or ownership of their lives in the educational process, I think I really hit a mark then. What I found is that through this work, I could show other students, young people, you know, you could be creative. You can, there's ways to make, make your way in the world. And even if you're not an artist per se, i.e. you make your living as an artist, whatever you end up doing, creativity can become part of that. And that's, that's kind of like my, my mantra now, that creativity is everywhere and we have to grasp it and hold on to it and nurture it in our young people and our old people as well. It's not something that's only the, the domain of the artist.